war in Ukraine. And tonight, for the first time, President Zelensky now confirming that a Ukrainian military offensive is underway some 18 miles inside Russia. Thousands of Russians have been forced to evacuate, and Vladimir Putin has been forced to call in reinforcements. Here's our chief foreign correspondent, Ian Panel, tonight. Tonight, the surprise Ukrainian offensive inside Russia expanding into another region. Video circulating online showing troops raising the blue and yellow flag of Ukraine in occupied villages. The commander-in-chief of Ukrainian forces tonight claiming they've taken around 380 square miles of Russian territory. Some estimate they could be as deep as 18 miles inside Russia. Thousands of Ukrainian troops are believed to have crossed into two border areas in the last week, around Kursk and now Belgorod, two places used to launch attacks on Ukraine. This is the moment a Ukrainian missile came crashing down in Kursk after being intercepted, seen in video online. Fierce firefights have been reported as Russia urgently sends in defensive units, attacking with drones and aircraft. Over 100,000 residents forced to flee their homes in a mirror image of the Russian occupation of Ukrainian towns and villages. President Zelensky confirming the operation, which has been shrouded in secrecy. Today, a rattle Putin holding an emergency meeting, ordering the defense ministry to push to kick the enemy out of our territory. Facts are few, but this is the biggest occupation of Russian territory by a foreign army since the Second World War. Russia claiming American and NATO military equipment is being used, which would be a potential breach of agreements, but no evidence is being offered. David, uh, Vladimir Putin claims that Ukraine's trying to improve its negotiating position in any future talks. In other words, trying to swap land for land. But it's an embarrassing blow for the Kremlin. And I think two key questions tonight. One, how far can Ukraine go? How much territory can it take? And two, can it hold on to it? David? We're watching this closely. Ian Panel with us tonight. Thank you, Ian.